Deadline has now come and gone for guaranteed ground shipping delivery by Christmas, but you can avoid any extra fees or delays altogether by shopping local. Yeah, that's especially important this year since hundreds of businesses across Dane County have closed, including more than two dozen on State Street. Our Christina Laurie headed downtown to find out what the future of that street might look like. Hi guys, we're back out here on State Street this morning talking about the importance of shopping local with Tiffany from downtown Madison. Tiffany, these businesses all along State Street have had a rough year to say the least. What are the numbers? I know you've been keeping track of how many, unfortunately, had to close. Yeah, it's been a really rough year for all small businesses. It's been especially difficult downtown on State Street. We had 153 businesses as of June 1st. We've unfortunately had 31 of those businesses announce permanent closures. And we have 14 of them that have launched GoFundMe campaigns in hopes that they will make it through and be here on the other side of the pandemic. And another way to support them besides just donating directly to their GoFundMe pages is to actually shop at them and get Absolutely. something. Absolutely. I mean, really, it's easy to support our local businesses. They've put in place measures so that you can do so safely. You could actually just shout out to them on Facebook and social media and tell them you're thinking about them. Or you can shop that way, too. Call them up. Instagram, email, all the mechanisms are available to reach out to our small businesses and make sure you support them. And Yelp reviews also can go a long way. Absolutely. If you wanted to provide a positive review or a share of your experience with your network of friends or your circle of friends, that means a lot to these small businesses right now. Absolutely. And hopefully folks at home can use this next week as an opportunity to get out here safely. Many of these businesses have put new safety measures in place and we've outlined those actually in the earlier half hour of this show so we'll post that on the website so you can know that you are safe when you're coming out here to shop small and shop local.